The latest update, quizzes and loads of RSGP. This is the hottest chat show on RuneScape. Rune Talk, have your say. Okay, hey guys, DJ Clacky's here. Um, and I am joined today by... Hi, I'm Power5. Um, Hi, I'm... As always, um, you can get involved... No, this is Rune Talk, and we have a great show lined up for you today, so... We're joined by um, Splite. Hello. And our community guest this week is Geo. Hello. Uh, Alastio will be joining us shortly, but let's just get on the show um, to start with, shall we? Okay. Um, how about the party view? That looks like a good topic to start us off with. Uh, big Definitely. bang next weekend. So you and are you going to be going to the party of the year? Yeah, I should be going. I haven't really looked up much information about it yet but i spotted in um thing information about it here and there so i'll be following up on that and hopefully attending definitely what about you gi <laughs> um i'm looking forward to topics here i'm yeah. sorry i just it, i got 120 dungeon and i'm being spammed like crazy <laughs> <laughs> no worries. congratulations congratulations thank you congratulations um so, so yeah the part of the year it's next week isn't it what? Yeah. Yeah, it's next week. Um, there's a bit of Castle Wars, Stealing Creations, Clan Wars, Fight Pits, and Games Room. So no, all sounds I'll be going quite... to the Games Room. Oh, Stealing Creation, how wonderful. A little bit of Rune Squares. I love Rune Squares. <laughs> I'm amazing at Rune Squares. You cannot beat me at Rune Squares. That's, work... what, you... That's what you think. I'll work for you all at Rune Versace. <laughs> Rune Versace is confusing. I, I haven't got a topic for it. Basically, you're fellow, but with. Yeah, I'm, I've never got into that. <laughs> yeah, so basically it starts next Saturday at 8 o'clock GMT and meeting at the GE entrance. And there's also the, the thread. I think I can put a link to that in the chat box in a sec for people. And they can check out more details. Um, but it, it looks like it's going to be really fun and there's some special guests to be confirmed. Uh, not sure what else. Anyone else got any other things to talk about it? Um, yeah, uh, sorry. Um, I know that we had a party last year, didn't we? And that turned out pretty good. I wasn't around for last year's party, so this year's party ought to be a good introduction to what it's like. Yeah. Yeah. to be very interesting. Yeah, I haven't been around <clears throat> that long, so I'm looking forward to it. I mean, there's a lot of events, so I'm going to be attending. Okay. Um, have you guys tried out Haiti and Skull yet? I know it's back again this year. Um, I quite enjoyed it last year, but I haven't actually got around to trying it this year. Yeah, what about you guys? I yeah, have. I've, <laughs> I've managed to get around to it, and I've went to Skull seems to be a lot more um, popular than Haiti this year. Like Last year you had tons and tons and tons of people camping around every single spawn point for for it, for Haiti, and this year basically if you run into it then eventually they'll just long come a massive like train of about 200 players and they suddenly go, there he is, tack it! And I was like, what? I- <laughs> I didn't. I didn't know that the wolf thing was actually um, part of. Because I remember, I I didn't know about it. I looked in my chest in my house, and there was this gap for Haiti wolf stuff. And I was like, "Are you joking me?" Because <laughs> I hate having gaps in my house. It's really annoying. I remember when it came last year, um, and when it came out, the day it came out. There was just everyone standing around. So you try and get one hit in, and before you know it, he's dead before you can even hit him. And then it takes like 20 minutes just to, just to get one hit on the guy, just so you can get your drop. Yeah, oh, yeah. It's- true. Last year it was a pain. This year I've noticed uh, Skull, not so much Haiti, but Skull is a lot more EOC friendly. I mean, it has like the Ring of Fire, which is a new element that they didn't have last year. Quite a bit of fun. 
Yeah, I'm looking yeah. forward to trying it out. I haven't actually got around to getting to it yet, and I know it's going to be some great bit of content. Um, and I, I quite like them having sort of repeatable things each year. So I mean, I like the sort of the, the Christmas events and the um, the sort of Easter events, New Year's, uh, not New Year's, sorry, but those sort of repeatable things that they can bring in each year, but then make slightly different. And I think Haiti's a great example of that. Yeah. Yeah. I enjoy my free. Agility XP though, sorry. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. The, the, the XP bonuses are definitely a. Um, who who a doesn't like bonus. agility XP? Oh gosh, it saves <laughs> oh, so much time. Agility, yeah. click, <laughs> click, click, click. Oh, tell me I, about it. I admit <laughs> I do Brimhaven. I do the Brimhaven course because it's a little bit different. Because you're not going round and round. You're going a bit left and a bit right and a bit forward. And but I still get bored. <laughs> Have you tried Flash Powder Factory? Uh, no, I've never heard of it. <laughs> this it's is why I'm a rogues. media. It's over in the rogues then. It's about, uh, I'm guessing if you're efficient, around 90k XP an hour. Awesome. You know, I don't it's train pretty... much, to be honest. I'm a major XP waster. Um, many people know this. I have like 300 play days, like... On my adventures log, I haven't got my vet cape yet, and yeah, I, don't have I have three ninety nines. Basically, I am the definition of XP wasting. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Mine's just a lot of no life ink stealing, cre stealing creations. <laughs> like I'm more of an XP waster, no ninety nines, and I've already got a vet cape. <laughs> got a vet cape, but no ninety nines at all. Yeah, I don't no, think I'm that's a necessarily a bad thing. I, I think 99s sometimes can be a bit overrated because you get a 99 and then it's a bit like, oh, okay, what, what, do, I do, what do I do now? You know, it's, I think maybe not getting a 99 and getting it through the course of doing it for a long time is maybe a better way of getting a 99. Um, yeah. I, yeah, I, I can it. see where you're understanding. Like, eventually, you know, you start running low on 99s. Like, for example, like, way I am right now, I'm at 2475 total. And I only have like five skills left, and it's like, I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> yeah, but that's why they've introduced like comp completion cape and that, because you're like you have something. Because they used to effigies were a perfect example of this, because you had nothing for higher level. You got to eighty, and you had nothing to do. Whereas yeah. now there's more things for higher levels. There's, um, I I got nine times the capes. I like the capes because I can get an outfit to go with it. <laughs> but that's just me. <laughs> Always Dude. thinking about your wardrobe. Hey, 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 hey! I'm, I'm a big fan scape. of the. I'm a big fan <laughs> of the Herblore cape with green dragon hide trimmed. That it's an amazing set. <laughs> yeah. I much yeah. prefer my just Gano with a classic cape or Castle Wolf kills cape, doesn't it? Mm. So I have so... been trying to make a. Um, a costume using the first tower, first tower robes. Yeah. I believe we now have a lustral with us. You do indeed, you lucky ducks. Hello. <laughs> we have the head of Rune Radio. I believe your title has been changed. It to. is now, yes, head of Rune Radio. There we go. Um, we graced with us with his presence. Um, so hello. I'll apologise again uh, for being late. My parents thought it'd be a lovely idea to order some some uh, Indian food for dinner and then have it arrive, you know, about 10 to 7 this evening. So I've been just kind of scoffing that quickly, but there's only a, there's a limit to how quickly you can scoff Indian food, so uh, here I am. I don't like yeah. it. I don't like spices. You have the same problem with a roast dinner. Oh, you can't scoff a roast dinner, <laughs> can you? <laughs> no. You've got to enjoy that. Especially when, it, yeah. <laughs> Especially when it's just out of the oven, too. <laughs> Put potato I in just your mouth, had... it just burns all your taste buds. I had plain pasta with the cheese. <laughs> okay, so dinner's <laughs> over. Um, shall we move on to the next topic, John? Yeah. Um, well, one of the ones I've personally, I, I was looking at the forums the other way when we were coming up with the topics, and there was a thread in the future updates talking about RuneScape interfaces, new, old, and sort of in the future. So I was thinking, sort of in game, what what, what interfaces do you like? What, what, what ones do you like the old ones of? What ones do you think? future one should be things like that so if you if you take like um 
the skilling interfaces, for example. So if you're fletching, you've got the new interfaces which sort of let help you do it all. If oh, you know what I mean, they're they're very good. They're they're informative to. Uh, oh, what's happening to my throat here? I need to get a drink in a sec. But um, they're they're helpful for new players. Um, they tell you exactly what you need. They tell you the XP you get, don't they? They tell you, pr I think market price, um, alk price. I think they tell you as well. It's it's very useful. Um, helps you con to determine whether or not you know you'll be making money by doing that. You know, it's just just very useful depending on what you're doing. Um, I think they're much they're an improvement over the old interfaces, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Th there's so many interfaces, though. I, I, I mean, you look at the combat. You know, they just reworked all of that. Um, they're still working on that, actually. I mean, they took care of the bots over at Mithril Dragons. Um, also, as like you brought up, skilling. I do like the new interfaces. Uh, they, you know, provide so much more information. It's just as long as it's not um, concept easier, whatever that <laughs> was. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So whilst we're on that topic, um, well, we're not actually on any topic at the moment. Um, Unique has sent in uh, excellent talk show topic: Zone of Aces. So I know we've got that started starting to go up. We've got the Twitter and the Facebook out. Um, so what are your guys' like opinions on that? Like, do you? I know Illustrial plays um, the Ace of Spades. I, I don't do. know about Geo. I think you and can't. No, I can card. now. I can. <laughs> can you? I can oh, now. Awesome. They've. I, I think they've lowered the um the requ system requirements for it or something. Oh. So I had the surprise of my life yesterday when I stashed it up and suddenly it just loaded up the main menu. I was like, oh, I can actually play it now instead of it just crashing whenever it gets to the main menu. How are you finding it? Awesome. Fair enough. I haven't actually had a chance to play a whole game yet. Oh, so you've loaded I mean, it, but you haven't played it. Yeah, literally <laughs> yesterday I had the time to double-click on the thing to try one last time after talking to one of the other DJs about it. Um, had time to just go, oh, I'll try this again, just double tap on it and it loaded up I was like oh I'll have to try that out sometime you, you just know you're going to try but... loading it again later and it's not going to work yeah I can see that coming you're going to be like oh I should have played it while I had the chance just <laughs> <laughs> mine just lagged terribly I'll, I need to sort my laptop out and I'll go try it but I've got it I got it cheap half price oh yeah, <laughs> I have lucky. not tried Ace of Spades um I don't know it just doesn't seem like a type of game that when Jay is, pro is promoting it, it just doesn't seem like the type of game that I would go for. However, I can see where many people would. I don't know. Maybe I'm just mm. too old and stubborn. I, I, I really <laughs> okay. enjoy it. It's great. It's, it's incredibly addictive. You know, you think, oh, I'll just have one more game. You know, I'm just not studying for exams at the moment or anything. You know, oh, I'll have one more game. It's only 20 minutes. Then, you know, 20 minutes later, oh, one more game. We nearly won that one. Carry on. Thing that you know, <laughs> Next thing you know, two hours later, you're still like, oh, just one more game. And next thing you know, it's 5 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, and, you got, and, and you've got an exam or a test the next day. <laughs> Bad and you still haven't done any revision or your homework or whatever. Yeah, I was up <laughs> it's to happened you, to everyone. I, I was actually awake until like 1 a.m. of the day of my physics exam without doing any revision at all and I just completely forgot that I had the exam in the morning so sort of oh. went to sleep and went oh, normal day tomorrow, woke up in the morning mum just asked me, oh, are you ready for your food exam? <laughs> I did that with a science test, I haven't had many exams but I had a science test to determine what set I'm in completely forgot about it, I got in a call I fell asleep at what, like 3am woke up going casually just going into my science and everyone's like are you ready for it wait what <laughs> oh but, yes i know you guys are all british i assume yeah yeah we are yeah uh, uh, see over here because i'm american we have a scene called the act it's basically this huge college pre-college exam you know see where you're at i'm predetermining stuff kind well, of like the Stats that we had before, before going into the secondary school. Also, my year was the last year, I believe, in Wales to do that. So yeah, and yeah, I, I didn't get, I didn't get out of that, and it was really annoying. 
And I ended up oh, staying up and at Sinning Creations until about 4 a.m. before that big test. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh my. That's, yeah. It's, but it's always a thing, isn't it? I mean, you're either, especially like everyone listening, I'm presuming most people listening will be gamers. It's just, you just get used to it. Yeah. I mean, like, I don't think I've yet, I think I've yet to switch back from my summertime. Like so, when I was in the summer holidays, what's what's going to what's what's bedtime? What's sleeping when it's still dark? I, I, <laughs> I always I, lose. Mm-hmm. I always lose track of that whenever I'm doing I anything. Re- Literally, I remember whenever it's holidays or weekends, I just lose track of time completely. Yeah, I remember just like um, being. I was on like RuneScape or whatever. Turned around, birds are singing. Sun's coming up. I think I might want to go to bed now. <laughs> I get that sometimes, don't you? You're like deep in, you know, you're playing Skate or another game, you know, you're deep into it, you, you're concentrating, you you maybe got a couple of friends as well playing with you, you know, you're just really into it. And then, because my clock's behind me, I turn around and then I'm like, oh God, when did it become 6.43 in the morning? And it's just like, <laughs> oh, that's depressing. Oh yeah, see... I remember when I was still living in the dorms, uh, I would play on my laptop, and I'd be up all night on it. All of a sudden, uh, the light would come in through the window and shine on my that glare on the laptop. I then I'd rage, I'd rage and be like, ah, to heck with it, and go to bed. <laughs> See, I love my sleep, but I can't get to sleep. I have trouble getting to sleep, but once I'm asleep, you can't wake me up. <laughs> Yeah, it's like I'm dead. <laughs> I will lie there and not like, oh, god. But the only thing is, I talk in my sleep. Oh. So I'm like, oh god. Like when when I fall asleep in calls, Skype calls, talking <laughs> in my sleep, is that I just worry about it. Yeah, pretty Skype. much. Um, it's it's. I don't know. I just get really tired, but I won't admit I'm tired, and I'll get really stubborn because everyone will be, Kathy, go to bed. No. I'm not going to bed. I think we've all had those sort of moments though, where we just don't want to go to bed because we're doing something, but then everyone but wants us to go to bed, and we're just like, I don't want to go to bed. It's nightly yeah. to me though. <laughs> yeah, and then you end up saying something like your guilty pleasure over the radio. Yeah, that's gonna. <laughs> I, it's gonna happen one of these days, Kathy. Every, every I just. Oh. <laughs> Oh, but yeah, the the issue with sleeping, it's always been, it's a, it's a very, it's a very this generation thing. My mum yeah. doesn't have it. She she, she does all the no. games, she she does all this, but she doesn't have sleeping issues. Also, she says. And it's not fair, which I know she doesn't because I have to hide from her every time she comes up and pretends that I'm asleep. Oh. I think everyone does that. Yeah, pretends they're asleep. Well, I'm listening. I'm very good at it. <laughs> okay, so shall we move on to the next topic? Um, what have we got? Snow. snow. Snow's quite a popular one, I think. And Definitely. Snow. I've seen tons of statuses about snow, statuses about where is my snow, I've never seen any. And, and, oh, anyway. I can never give you tons of it. It's, that's, it's still that's snowing like here. Same story mm. here. I think look how... The last three days. Yeah. I get the day off school tomorrow, but I had a French trip. <laughs> I have an exam tomorrow, so, so I can't have the day off, even if it did snow. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Holiday tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. Some of us have work, so we kind of don't get out of that, even if it's snowing. <laughs> yeah, well. What's work? It, 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 never, it's something. What's this word? <laughs> <laughs> what's this word? I've never heard of it. Uh, <laughs> I think that you'll have to do one day, Kathy. It's like school. One day. But hard. School, but hard. Nothing can be hard in school. <laughs> yeah, it can. Be that's what. That's hard. what you think. But it involves yeah. waking up. <laughs> Depends what kind of job you work. Have. Wait, what? <laughs> but yeah, I do I work, mean, guys. Okay. I'm not lazy no. most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> I do do stuff. I'm sure other people disagree, but anyway. Um, yeah. I'm, I'm not. No, no, it's like if you guys want snow, you just. Come here, take it. I, we don't want it. 
I know, um, like Take Simon, Ali, Lizzie, they don't have snow apparently. Oh, they can have it. To be fair, they're in the southern hem- hemisphere. Well, Lizzie isn't, but she's in Texas, like South Texas. Yeah, it doesn't snow there. And it, then, like, it's, uh, it's taller than my sh- it's t- sorry, it's taller than my foot. The snow covers yeah. my foot when I put my foot down in it. <laughs> no one can look to my knees. I don't know if you guys oh, use uh, Fahrenheit or Celsius, but like Celsius. Oh, Celsius. This our high is like negative twenty Celsius. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I'm just like, oh, forget this. Oh, not going bed. outside. No. <laughs> Where is my bed? <laughs> like, yeah, I'm happy. It's a holiday tomorrow. <laughs> Cold's better than warm, though, isn't it? Because you can't do anything about it when you're hot, apart from, like, fan yourself. Whereas when you're cold, you just, like, you, you wear so many clothes, you don't think you've got any left in your wardrobe. Winter, I can, I can just... Winter. Well, that, but... True, I think I can just put up with the warmth a lot better than the cold. <laughs> I just, I went out for a snowball fight today in a short sleeve t-shirt and um, shorts. That's very smart, Ewan. You're insane. <laughs> my my brother um, was throwing snowballs at my mum before we came home from my grandma's. Um, so I just like got out, and I, I hadn't got gloves, but I, I then, just to do it, I then chucked a snowball at my mum's head and ran. <laughs> I got my proper time too, run. <laughs> yeah. I got my brother in the face one with one earlier. <laughs> Yeah, his name, he turns around, flung a snowball in his face, and went, oops. Because I didn't mean to do that at all. Dodgy eyes. Not at <laughs> all. Um, so, yes. Um, we've had a torture topic. Done. M. Roberts 301. What's everyone's v- views on Rune Lotto? So, Rune Lotto. Uh, Geo, have you entered it? Rune Lotto, I have seen it. I just, I think I'm gonna donate it to it eventually. Uh, I just, I don't know. The last few weeks, I've been like focusing hardcore on dungeoneering because I wanted to get that to 120. So I haven't even been on the listening to the radio because you know all that lag is bad for dungeoneering. Well, you need to listen to the radio. Well, I do when I'm not there. It makes there, but time just, go so much quicker. That's what it, we're here for. I know, it does. It's just, when you're putting up, uh, when you're opening doors, plus the radio on, plus Skype, it's just a never-ending leg. And it's quite <laughs> annoying. Yeah. Oh, trust me, like I, I know the story. <laughs> yeah, like I said, my laptop needs to be, like, looked at, but... I'm just lazy. I ought to like I've got League of Legends and stuff like that that I ought to that I never go on because I'm lazy. Um, <laughs> that I mean, just just get rid of them and it'll be easier. But yeah. um, so for your um dungeoneering, I don't like dungeoneering. Admittedly, it's a mini game to me. Um, yeah, same but here. <laughs> I can see why people like it. I mean. Um, how do you feel about the whole 120 thing? Glad to be done. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you're wondering about if the skills should have gone to 120, I could see to a certain point because when you're in it, let's, for example, 119 to 120, it's an insane amount of XP. It's 10 mil XP uh, just for that one level. And it seems like a lot, and it is. It's just. When you're up on your higher warp floors and you're getting 200,000 XP a floor, you you know, it kind of averages out to your normal skill. Yeah. Would you want them to make every skill 120 or just no, stay away? Oh, no. No way. No way. <laughs> okay, first off, can you see anyone getting 104 mil XP in Slayer? No. Yeah. No. yeah. <laughs> Eventually, yeah, yes. Eventually. 120 agility. Okay. Oh, oh, agility, I, no. no. Agility. No. Leave Give yourself it. something to use your XP. 120 farming. Farming wouldn't bother me. 
It's expensive. Farming takes but... the mix for me. Takes so Farming's. Long. I avoid it. What was that last like... year? Sorry. <laughs> what was who? I'd like to see um, more of the non-combat skills going up to 120. Like, but because of the non, the combat skills, they've got a lack of um, content as it is for the higher level. I just couldn't see how they'd make more of it to come in for 120. But all the other stuff, like runecrafting and stuff like that, I suppose you couldn't really fill that up either. But there's other things like mm -hmm. hunter and fletching and stuff like that. You could always find more things to put in them. Yeah. All right. And you make them go up that be. extra little bit. Yeah. True. Um so for the going back to the, like the hundred and twenty thing, would you see them making the new skills a hundred and twenty? No. Good. <laughs> One <laughs> they they said uh they weren't going going to another skill to 120 which I'm insanely happy about because mm. it's tedious and second the new skill is going to be a gathering skill mining and fishing wood cutting you know a gather skill and yeah I don't see myself doing one of those until 120 that would yeah <laughs> yeah un understandable <laughs> um illustrial I I know you, for example, the farming. What? Uh, are you okay? I'm, I'm fine. You you just seem quite quiet. No, I'm, I'm good, I'm good, I'm, I'm here, I'm just... Uh, okay, I'm, I'm just checking, I'm not normal. It's nice that you care um, about I'm... me. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're just saying I because quiet is initially. kind of out of the ordinary. Okay. <laughs> Well, um, I'm just, I'm just sort of like, I know you've got, you're quite close to 99 farming, and that's the skill most people see as, like, quite boring, tedious, I, would, would you... I like didn't farming. find it boring, I, I just found it expensive, because, I mean, a farm run takes, what, 20 minutes, if you're really slow like me and not concentrate, you know, 20 minutes a day, for yeah. how much XP, over 100k XP a day, you know, it's, it's not bad, it's not like it's, it requires a lot of work, it's just expensive, and... Require, it does require some commitment. You've got to do it every day if you want to get the maximum XP. But it's not really. A, I didn't really mind training it. It was just something I did on the side to other skills. Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing 99 farming right now as well, and it, most people find it, you know, insanely expensive. And I'll honestly agree, it is because 92 to 99 alone cost me 120 mil, something like that. But you know, it takes because I because what I do I use magic trees, palm trees. I got tons of spirit tree seeds along with fell stock, and you get all this XP. I mean, and then also you do calquat daily. That's about I don't know 200k XP a day, and it only takes you about 10 minutes. Yeah. Can't really can't really complain. I can. Um, <laughs> I can complain about anything. Not that I do. You do, but, um, really. Okay. Life. <laughs> <laughs> right. Let's move on to the uh, desert tasks. Um, like, so for the desert tasks, I I haven't. The only task I've completely completed, not good choice of words there. Um, it's lumbridge ones, and I just don't bother with much else would i don't know have you guys completed like illustrial you and do you have you completed the desert tasks i'm not even out yet i haven't started not, no, even out. not the desert tasks okay <laughs> <laughs> have, you complete... <laughs> have you completed <laughs> any tasks I, I i can find out my list here. i've completed the lumbridge ones i've completed 133 out of 131 apparently somehow uh, Varrock, I've completed, yeah. Uh, Falador, I've completed. Sis Village, completed. Oh, God, I've done well, actually. Uh, Ardoin, <laughs> no. Oh, need a few left there. Karamja, no. Fremenic, no. Uh, Mauritania, no. Berthorp, oh, no, that's not even... Tough. Wait, there's the Mauritania ones? Yeah. Yes. They came that's out the out. most annoying one. They came out last year. Wait. I've got... Mm. 
I've done all of them except a few Mauritania ones, and those are really the most tedious, annoying task set I've ever seen. <laughs> Just I'm well, one of the tasks you have to get every character of Temple Trekking up to 99, and it's just like, ay. I See, I didn't finish that, because <laughs> when Temple Trekking got um, revamped, I, I was playing that, that minigame quite a lot, just to get the rewards. I don't know why I was playing it, to be honest. It, was, it wasn't that exciting, to be honest, but it it passed the time, and it was. I just I just really enjoyed playing new content a lot, although I say that, I've not been to the Calphite King since day of release, but <laughs> I digress. Um, but I think... I don't want to go to Calphite King, I don't want to die. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just hoping that the um, desert task set isn't full of just ridiculously tedious things, and they're they're fairly basic. I mean, obviously for the elite ones, you've got to have some some ones that require a lot of either grinding or high skills, you know, things like that. Well, I also see, you know, one of the medium tasks anyway is going to be, I'm sure, the cactus. You know, over in Alcred. Oh yeah. You got to plant your cactus. I can see that coming already. Also, pickpocketing guards and all that. I. There's tons of stuff I can see coming, but I like the easy ones. Desert Strike one, <laughs> probably on there. Oh I can't yeah. Do, I can't do difficult ones. Because they're difficult. I can see me. I want to see. <laughs> I, I want to see an elite one beat the Calphite Queen. You know, just the Queen, just solo it. Solo the Calphite King. That'd be a good one. Oh no, no. <laughs> I, I can do that. Goodbye, Has master. that been done yet? Uh, no, it has. No, in, it's actually impossible. In the uh, the community round, it is impossible because one of the isn't one of the attacks of it. So it makes any hit that next hit that lands on you a one hit insta kill. Yeah, because basically what it something like does what it does basically you you could I would assume you could like survive it. It's just that you'd have to have insanely good timing. Because the, you're right, it does have that attack, and it'll make your character or avatar, or whatever, uh, turn green. And when that happens, you're going to die. Get one hit, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you use resonance. Yeah. No, but the thing is, if you're in a solo, you can't use resonance. I don't think because when the Calphite King does that, it stops you using any abilities. Oh, so uh, you, yeah. you, you need someone else in the team to absorb that attack, or you're going to die. Yeah, provoke and resonance. But it's so yeah, it it's unsolvable. I, <laughs> I can do the dying part. That, that'd be an easy one. <laughs> die at the Calphite King. <laughs> I can do that. I did that to get the music track. I walked in. I think it was a glitch on the first day because. I went there on the first day with no no armor or anything. I was just going to go in, get the music track, and die. I, I think there was a glitch because it went in, it one-hit me, and I died, okay? And then I spawned in Vera. Then I turned green right <laughs> as soon as I died, and then I died again <laughs> in Vera. I was just like, I just sat there looking at it. It was like, what, what just How happened? How did you die twice? That was just confusing me. Well, Am I just like being a, blonde? I think I'm just being well, blonde. This, it's like a special <laughs> attack. It's like the special attack that uh, uh, Calphite King has. You turn green, bam, you die. And I turned green as I died. Uh, and so, uh, that makes a bit <laughs> sense. I think they yeah. fixed that, though. Yeah. Weird. <laughs> Alright. I just get confused easily. Um yeah, we so, all know that. That's not very nice. Um <laughs> <laughs> So for like do you think because with Queen Black Dragon they had a quest, didn't they? That took you into Queen Black Dragon. Yeah. Do you think that worked well? Or because they didn't do that with the uh, Calphite King. I, I think that worked well because it, it helped introduce the, the law behind it because I mean the Cal the the, uh, what was it, Queen Black Dragon, there was obviously a lot of lore behind it. Um, I, I don't, I'm not myself personally interested in lore and things, but there are people out there who are. I don't think the, the Calphite King, I don't think it had as much attached to it as the, the Queen Black Dragon did. I mean, obviously it was a highly anticipated boss, but I don't think it was as 
built into the the storyline of the game. If if that makes sense, I'm, I don't get it. Mm. I want to know something. Sure. Didn't they put the King Black Dragon and the Cow Fight Queen like together, like for the coronation? No, not the wedding. Uh, yes. <laughs> yeah. So, so, so what happens now? They have the the, the Queen Black Queen Black Dragon and the Cow Fight King. Does the, do those two get together, or do they divorce? No, they stuck. Oh, that. The Cow Fight King and the Queen Black Dragon they they cheat on their other halves with each other, so. It's like a bit of a love square going on. Future quest. <laughs> yeah. Future quest. A quest series. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> take notes. Okay, one take of the notes. requirements for the King Back Dragon section is survive. <laughs> yeah, I think, you know, when you look at the Queen Black Dragon storyline and, you know, the lore, you say. I don't know if that really helped as much because it took you into the place, you know, it showed uh, basically why the White Knights were there, everything, you know, why they were there. But it didn't, you know, it, you know, being a novice quest, it wasn't really long or that informative and it just stopped right at the Kelphite King, Queen, uh, blah, excuse me, Queen, Queen Black, Black Dragon, Dragon. <laughs> uh, Queen Black Dragon Lair and it's just like, didn't mention anything about it, and I walk in, get one hit by the fire, and yeah, I'm just, <laughs> I, I was like, "What is this?" <laughs> yeah, I remember watching the video of Illustra dying. That no, that was depressing. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I lost my um, what did I lose? I lost my chaotic rapier. I lost full bandos, and oh, what else? Was it? I don't know. It was depressing though. Oh my god! Thanks. Just I'm brought sorry. up bad times. How did you okay, the grave so pops up it was Sorry. the gravestone glitch. My grave was oh. there. It made but my me giggle. It made me laugh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I like. I like. I like the old videos. They made me laugh. What? Because I died. No, not like you didn't die in all of them. Oh, thanks. All of them. You didn't die in all of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so basically, um, I think this is um, near the end of the talk show bit. Um, you guys, usually we have um, a quiz. How we're doing something a little bit different that involves you guys. <gasps> so we want you to <laughs> oh we boy. want you to get into game right now. Ward eighty three, Rune Zone friends chat, and we're gonna do a bit of hide and seek. Um, we're gonna say goodbye to Geo. All so right, thank goodbye. you, Geo, for participating. Sign order. And then the four of us, which consists of myself, um, Ewan, Illustrial, and John, are going to go in-game and hide. We're going to give you clues in a little bit. Um, and then we're going to uh, um, see who gets there. First to trade, we'll get 100k from each of us. So 400k is up for grabs. So meet us there. Remember, Rooms on Friends chat. We're going to have this one song to uh, get ourselves sorted. But World 83, Rune Zone Friends Chat. We'll see you there. And thank you again to Illustrial. Hi, I'm still here. Geo. Thank you, it was a pleasure. <laughs> and <laughs> Ewan. Thanks for having me on. And of course, Power 5. We'll see you again soon. This is the hottest chat show on RuneScape. Rune Talk, have your say. Okay, hey guys, we are back. Um, with our hide and seek, we should all be logged in in game. Um, one second, yeah. Just in. Okay. yeah. Um, so we're all on mod eighty three. Our privates are off. I trust. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> um, and we're all in the rooms and friends chat. So it's first to trade us. We're gonna go through with our hints. The first hints only, guys, and we'll go in order. So Illustrial, you go first. Um, I read about my hints. Yeah. Just the first one. Just the first, Just the first one. one. Okay. Uh, the first hint is poor dead guy. That's a really so bad if you hint. want to go after Illustrial, go for that one. Um, and for me, it's would fishing here work? So if you want to go after me, that's your uh, And for me, and for me is will I hit the right note? So uh, yeah, come find me. Will I hit the right note? You in? And for me, it's scorpions by the ton. So if you have any idea where I would be, come find me. 
Good luck. Remember first to trade. Um, we'll probably just talk for a little bit, and if someone finds someone, if in five minutes no one's found anyone, we'll give our second hint, or if someone of us haven't been found. So, shall we just talk for a little bit and see if they find us? I'm going to give out 200k yeah. now. Oh, are you? Doubling the profits. Come for me. I, 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 poor dead I, I might beat that 200k double. Double trouble. 400k. 200 then. Yeah, we 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 yeah. all go two hundred now. I love how I just cost everybody so, here extra money. <laughs> uh, I'll, you, you owe me later for it, Illustrial. I don't really. I'll, I'll get it off of you later. Anyway. Yeah, most of my money has gone on my guest tune. I'm gonna have to make money soon <laughs> just for the guest tune. <laughs> Start um, merging. What the fuck? Wait, what? I can't tell if he's joking or not. Um, he's not joking. Oh, okay. What is matching? Flipping. Oh, I can flip. Things. I, Buying I, things for low, selling things for high. The I've done that before. Backwards of I everything. I can actually do that, that. The economy's meant to Oh, I think I've been work. found. Okay. Have, Have you been you? found? Oh, God. Oh, Mayor Berries. Have they traded they're you? They've not traded me, but they're in the French chat and they're calling me a noob. You have to trade him for the 200k. You have to trade me. I don't know who this is. Who is this? What's your What's your room zone name? Saying it. Saying the. Uh, He's right uh, away from me. That's Geo, apparently. Oh, that's Geo. Okay, never mind. Forget. Oh, I've been found. Cameron's found me. <laughs> Ooh, bank pin. Okay, let's see. <laughs> bank pin. I'm so prepared, you see. Um, apologies if you just heard that. Chat. <laughs> <laughs> apologies. Okay, so Cameron's found me. Have you been actually found yet, Alastria? Uh, no, I've not been found now. Okay. That that, that so. was Gio, who, who kind of knew where we were anyway. Oh. <laughs> I, I cheat, Gio. I, 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 <laughs> Illust, Illustrial hasn't been found yet. Uh, so, and neither have you two, have you? No, nope, yeah. I'm still. We haven't been found yet. Yeah, that's a good point. I was found. I was in Mudskipper's Point. My clue was, can I fish here? Because you, like... I think you kind of fish for the things. And then my second would have been quite nice to have a beach party here because I remember we once came here like as rooms owners and we had like a beach party thing and I remember Nathan giving out two mil. Ooh. That's all I remember. Uh, I, know, I, know there, I know there are lots of parties as well in that sort of area from yeah. Jagex as well. I know they like to hold their beach parties around there. And... It's a beach. It's quite a nice beach, isn't it? You know? Yeah. Yeah. Lots so, to do around there. Beach, fairy ring, you know, just chilling and life's a beach. You got the ogre right? things. Whatever they call <laughs> Illustrial's a beach. I was a beach once. <laughs> <laughs> what what what, oh, what kind of that? beach? Sand or stone? Uh sand. Gotta be sand. Sandy beaches. I don't like stone beaches, they hurt my feet. Stone beaches aren't really beaches. Google beach puns. Puns from the beach. Okay. So should we read our second clues out, or do one of you want to read your second clue out, and then the others can wait a little bit? Have I been found now? Well, have they traded you? No, but uh, Vanilla just said where I am in the uh, friend chat. Where did Vanilla that, say uh, that? Oh Vanilla! Vanilla! <laughs> okay. So, so, so now it's well, basically it's, it's a race to get Yeah, now. first one to trade me gets 200k. Come QBD lay. It's just where I am, you know, just... Good one, Okay, John, why don't you say your second clue? Okay, my second clue was I wonder what this mound is. <laughs> oh, I, I've been found. I've been found. Have you? Who by? You found you. Monkey King. Oh! That's there, but Monkey Obviously, I, I'm. I, I'm going to get hit by the uh, the pin, and I'm not going to get hit by the pin thing. Oh, really? Jealous. Okay. You and should we try you? Do you want to read your second clue out? <laughs> and then, my second clue is, I wonder if the dwarf will let me in. What was your first? And, uh, and my first one was scorpions by the ton. So scorpions by the ton, and I wonder if the dwarves will let me in. Has Come it try and find me. Yeah, Illustria. Winner, winner, winner. Spexy penguin takes the win. He got me <laughs> and you. Hey, Smitty Penguin. Just okay. <laughs> Grats, Smitty Penguin. Grats, 200k. He's a penguin, so, see, penguins are amazing. 
He got 400k off us. Congrats there. So, Tishing has won. And, yeah, totally. Um, so, Smexy Penguin's got two of us. And Monkey King has one of us. Are you going to find Ewan? Probably not. <laughs> I don't have a third clue, guys. Come on. Wait, which one is... <laughs> is Ewan the bottom one? Just, yes, right. I'm the bottom one. Okay, right. Um... Clues for that? Ooh, I don't have any clues for that. Uh, I, I can think of a few, but they're quite very obvious. <laughs> okay, well, yeah, don't okay, say we anything we obvious. Wait for minute, that shall we? we wait for oh, a minute. Oh, 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 oh. I see a purple dot on the mini map. Don't Ooh. run away. It's a bit yep. rude. Here's <laughs> Nick the Fox has found Oh, well done, Nick. So Nick has 200k. So where are you? I was in Falador. Oh, mine. <laughs> Doesn't he know where he was? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Um, I hope... forgot. I've been here for an hour. <laughs> we hope you guys enjoyed that. So, I'm going to say thank you again to Gio, who's not here anymore. But thank you very much. Um, thank you to Illustria. Uh, you are very welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Um, Ewan, as well. Thank you. Thanks for having me on. And I guess I have to say thank you to John as well. You, you can do if you like. Also, if you have just tuned in and thinking, hey, what have I missed? Uh, I'm sure it will be on the YouTube channel soon. It will be. Um, Illustrial? Yeah. El Illustrial Go? No? Oh, oh sorry, you pressed the button. You didn't press the Illustrial oh, button. button. Illustrial Button Go. Uh, Runes on a con No, fuck, I can't even do it now. YouTube.com oh, forward but... slash Runes on videos. <laughs> I there we go, eventually. <laughs> oh. I tried at the beginning, but I couldn't do it as good as you. I think in future I'll leave that for Kathy and Illustrial to do. You should do. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, you can catch the episode one and two if you've just tuned in and you didn't know. Um, we've also got a feedback topic pinned by Anita. And if you're wondering, I'm still not quite sure what this is about. Josh's pin topic so make sure you check those two out we need feedback because we just want to make this better for you guys because we love what we do and we love doing it for you guys so feedback help us make it better and if you want to um, join us Josh's topic and read through it if you've got the requirements Skype name and RuneScape no not RuneScape name why would we need your RuneScape name John I'm talking gibberish please take over um, th this is Rune Talk um the, the, the hottest chat show on Rune, Rune Radio? YouTube.com. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah well, I can't remember the slogan. Illustrial. Uh, what, what was the, the, the... Just play the jingle. Play the jingle, Kathy. <laughs> play the jingle. Play the jingle. Play the jingle. <laughs> and then we... Okay, okay. Play the jingle. Where's the, ji where's the jingle? Oh, God. <laughs> this is God. going well. <laughs> playing the jingle. No, playing the jingle. No. Do I play the jingle? I'll play the jingle. Just play the jingle. The latest updates, quizzes, and loads of RSGP. This is the hottest chat show on RuneScape. Rune Talk, have your say. So that was the jingle. Um, we know who we are now. DJ, yeah, we know who we are. <laughs> I'm DJ Quackies. He's. I, I'm. I'm not a DJ anymore. I'm Power Five. Hello. Content. He did. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm. I'm a white person now. Yeah. He ditched me. He traded he white. He traded purple for white. Um, but yeah, just so you guys know, if anyone was wondering, it's not going to affect Rune Talk. I'm going to do the DJ stuff, and he's just going to tell me what to do. <laughs> that sounds like normal Rune Talk then. <laughs> right then. So, <laughs> um, um, we've thanks everyone for listening. You've enjoyed DJ Unique will be on next, and this is every week. So make sure you're tuned in at the same time, 7 p.m. GMT. Be there. You do not know what you're missing otherwise. I hope you've enjoyed. And thanks again. How many times am I saying thank you? I think it's a I lot don't know. I think now. we should just I, I think we should just go, Kathy, and say thank you very much, guys. Bye. Bye guys. We will see Bye -bye. you next week. Bye. The latest updates, quizzes, and loads of RSGP. This is the hottest chat show on RuneScape. Rune Talk, have your say.